These teams are prepared for an epic series. Two of the West very best clashing in game one of the conference semis. I'm Brian Anderson here with Grant Hill, Steve Smith, and Allie LaForce. Allie, it's all yours. Thanks, Brian. CJ McCollum is looking to evolve his game. He said, quote, I can get out of bed and get 20. Now I need to score efficiently, make my teammates better, and impact the game in every facet. You get older, the maturity level shifts, and you understand what needs to be done. Guys? Well, looking to show how he can impact winning, Allie. Thanks for that. So the opening lineup here for the Clippers. The two-way threats of George and Leonard of the wing pair. Even to Zubats out there with Miles Bridges. And it's Wall in at the point. And for the Pelicans. Zion and Valanchunas playing up front. C.J. McCollum is out there with Evan Fournier. And it's Ingram in at the three. Tip-off goes to the Clippers. George outside. Outside wall. Pass to Zubox. Bridges with it. Covered by Williamson. Shot clock at six. Fades away. Oh, and that one had the right spin on it. It's good. I mean, what do you expect when you give him the clear look? That's just too easy. And early on, if you're him, you just want to see the ball go through the net and get into some kind of rhythm. Now here's Fournier. Back to McCollum. Shoots over Wall. McCollum's shot is off. He expects to make every one of those, and we expect him to make them too. Leonard against Ingram. Now here's Leonard. Tightly guarded. Shot from the low post is good. The power, the length, the ability to finish. Leonard dominant in that painted area. Pass to McCollum. Williamson with it. Launches it. And it's McCollum. That time on the assist from Williamson. He's consistent from out there. Especially when you give him that kind of room. George outside. Now Leonard. Let's the three fly. Hits the three-pointer. Leonard's got five now. There is the response. Kawhi rarely changes expression. But you know what he's thinking. I got your back. McCullum against Wall. McCullum, a pass to Williamson. And there it is for him. Just taking it right to the rim. And no one was there to greet him. Wow, that's a defensive breakdown. Can't do that against good scores. Now here's George. Leonard outside. Over Ingram. The offensive rebound. Pass to George. Outside Wall. And here's Leonard. Goes up again. Again, the miss by Leonard. Out left to the wing. Here's Williamson. Oh, Williamson throws it down. Unbelievable hang time. Giving the crowd its money's worth. Go ahead, Zion. Leonard outside. Back to wall. From deep. It's good. And the assist that time from Leonard. Hey, good to get him going right away. I mean, those are the shots that really boost confidence. When he's feeling good, he can help you stretch the defense a lot. Pass to Valanciunas. Back to Fournier. Oh, George with a steal. From down in the low post, it goes. Great hustle by Paul, using his speed in the open court. And then, of course, he's an excellent finisher. Now here's Fournier. First quarter of action, just under three and a half minutes played. Five on the clock. Here's McCollum. The Clippers grab the miss. Bridges, right side. Uses the glass to finish the layup. Bridges has got his second basket of the night. And you want to get him going as soon as possible. Great way for him to start this game. And we know once he gets in the rhythm, he's a really tough guy to stop. 
Yeah, you have to knock those down. Open shots inside the arc are rare in this league. Fournier against George. They double team George. Now here's Bridges. Defense right on him. Over Ingram. And there's another one for the Clippers. And their offense looking like a well-oiled machine. The Pelicans have gone three of six from the floor. Boy, they'd love if anyone could get a bucket. Yeah, their offense has been grinding to a halt. Ball against Ingram. Pass to Fournier. Will it go? Second chance effort. And Valanciunas with the lay-in. The persistence of Valanciunas paying off in a big way on the glass. He is just a tremendously hard worker. Ball pass to Zubat. Back to Wall. The three is up. Knocks down the long J. Wall's got six. This has been just a dreadful start for them defensively. Not good at all. Left side Ingram. Pass to Fournier. Knocked away. And the foul is called. He missed it. So he's got a couple of free throws coming his way. And let's quickly check out the scoring breakdown here for Los Angeles. They came out firing from deep. It's always good for a team's confidence when you can start a game that hot. And, and another thing, they found the open man. Really playing unselfish basketball, moving the ball around there on the perimeter. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And he drops the first. Fournier hits them both. Now George. Outside wall. Leonard outside. Back to wall. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. Standing at 6-4, Wall is a big point guard. That size along with his handles help him operate inside. Taking two shots. Now one misses. And after a series of major injuries, Wall still remains one of the more athletic players in this league. Second free throw is good. New Orleans has gone one or two from three-point land so far. McCullum, pass to Ingram. McCullum against Wall. Pass to Valanciunas. Outside Fournier. Oh, George with a steal. And it's the Clippers on the break. And the jam by George. A terrific ball the PG-13 knows it's a priority to create turnovers that spark the running game. Now here's McCollum. Counted from distance. McCollum's got the second bucket on the night. We know he has the range, and we know he has the attack mindset. Leonard passes to Bridges. Pass to George. Just four to shoot. Let's it go. Boy, clanks that one off the back iron and it falls. George has got six. And early on, they've been on a tear. Just getting whatever they want offensively. They established the pace. They made shots. This is why they're way out in front. 
New Orleans calls timeout. Let's give Coach credit. He's trying to find a way to squeeze the most out of every possession. Critical part of the game. You have to be flexible. You have to be able to adjust what you're doing. new group for the Pelicans. Here's Alvarado. Wall covering. Pass to Alvarado. And the Pelicans get it back. Jones' his shot is good. Effort play pursuing the basketball. Love how he puts in the work. George outside. And here's Batum. Powell outside. Shoots it from the high post. No good that time. And it's New Orleans taking it the other way. Let's it go from 14. Rebound by the Clippers. Pass to Morris. The three. Nance pulls down the board. The Pelicans have got half their attempts to go. Six of 12. Here's Jones. That's tipped. And as it goes out of bounds, New Orleans will keep possession. Here's Little. Still getting warmed up offensively. No buckets yet in the game from him. Six to shoot. And he was camped in the lane there. He gets a three-second call. The Clippers in the lead. And here's Wall. He's got seven. He takes it in. Pass to Powell. There's the three. Always a nice way to start. Makes his first one. Three points. An excellent perimeter offense so far. Their shooters are clearly in a great rhythm. Outside Jones. Now here's Nance. Guarded by Morris. Jones in the post. He's working on Morris. And there's a whistle. He'll head to the line to shoot two. That one on Morris. Second team foul. The line for your Pelicans, Herbert Jones. Two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. That free throw, no good. On the second one. Los Angeles has gone four or five from distance here in the first quarter. Powell outside. Back to Wall. Free throw line jumper. Good as the jump shot falls. Wall's got nine points. New Orleans has gone two for three from outside the arc. Pass to Little. Hook loose. And here's Hayes. From 11 feet away. And it's good. Off the back rim and in. <laughs> They're not messing around. 
Five of their last six buckets have come from the interior. Outside wall. George outside. Powell for three. Nance pulls down the board. The Pelicans have gotten 7 of 13 shots to drop. Outside Jones. That shot, no good. Ball with the defensive effort. Here's George. The kick out to Wall. Batum outside. Pass to Wall. Clock at six. Here's Powell. Here's Batum. Shot blocked. And there's the shot clock violation. Couldn't get the shot off in time. And the fans love seeing incredible moments on defense like that block. Oh, you could feel the playoff intensity in that block. He's playing some extra aggressive defense out there. And the Clippers making a change here. Herter's checked in. Here's Alvarado. Wall covering. A minute 35 left in the first quarter of the game. Dance finds Jones. Six on the shot clock. Here's Alvarado. Launches a three. Batum pulls it in. Pass to Powell. Herder with it. Powell outside. From deep three-point range. And it's Little with a rebound. New Orleans has gone two for four from range to start things off. From 12 feet, deflected. A sneaky present at the defensive end. Nicholas Batum was all over that shot. Tipped away. Back to Little. And with that one, the deficit trimmed to single digits. Time and time again, they're creating good looks from close range. Six second difference between the shot clock and game clock. Wall, the pass to Morris. Back to Wall. Just five on the clock. And the Clippers miss again. Here's Little. Here's Alvarado. No good on the buzzer beater. And so it's John Wall making highlights for the Clippers. Hunting for opportunities, leading to nine points in the quarter. We'll be right back after this word. Continuing our coverage of the Western Conference semifinals. Glad to have you back. And let's quickly break down the game we've seen from the Clippers guys. Well, it seems like they went in looking to do damage from long range, and they faced little resistance. Reason why excellent spacing. They may not stay this hot all game, but hard to bet against them. The Pelicans trail. In it forward, it's Ingram and Williamson. Evan Fournier is out there with C.J. McCollum. And it's Valanchunas in at the center position. That's the Pelicans' five. And great job to establish position and square up. Los Angeles has got four of seven threes to go so far in this game. Outside Herter. The officials whistle a foul on the shot. That's good. The bucket is good, and he'll go to the line. You can see Kevin Hurd has been working on this, taking contact and completing the play. Shooting for LA. Kevin Hurd at the line for one. Free throw, no good. 
with size in the backcourt. It's such an advantage. Kevin Herter is 6'6 with a long frame. And he stays with it. Williamson finds Ingram. And it's McCollum penetrating over Herter. And it's McCollum. That time on the assist by Ingram. That took some courage to take on the bigger defender right there. And he got the job done. Kennard outside. Leonard for three. On target from range. Leonard's got eight points. With a high basketball IQ and improving playmaking abilities, Luke's groin as a distributor. Down low. Shots good by McCollum. McCollum's got four points now in the quarter. Hey, they're just getting pushed around inside. Leonard outside. Pass to Kennard. Bridges against Williamson. Here's Herter. Takes it into the teeth of the D and converts the layup. Herter's gotten his second bucket. Physical D right there, but Herter's mentally tough. Never lost focus. Ingram, the pass to Williamson. And the shot counts. He's fouled, and it's a chance for a three-point play. Defensive foul. Miles Paul George, he's checked in for Herter. Personal foul. First team foul. At the line for your Pelicans. By the way, by the way. One shot. Shooting one. That's good from Williamson. And we all know about Zion Williamson's athleticism. Now he must continue adding to his game. George outside. Pass to Zubac. Shot clock at six. Here's Leonard. And it's in after a nice bounce off the right iron. He's got ten. What concentration from Kawhi Leonard rising up and firing him. George against Fournier. Now Valanchunas. To the paint. And he floats it in for the easy two. Credit the sweet setup on that one. Look at the big man Valanchunas showing off the playmaking skills. Leonard passes to Kennard. It's good. And the assist that time from Leonard. For three. Kennard's got his first three points of the game. And taking a look at this first half, they've just shown better shot selection. What they have done is ran their plays all the way through until they get something they like. And both teams running long-range plays that are working. How often do we see this these days? Clubs answering each other from range. Now here's Bridges. Six points for him. And it's going to be a three-second call. New Orleans has gone one of two from deep in the second quarter. McCollum, a pass to Valanchunas. Ingram on the wing. Outside Fournier. Four on the clock. And the foul called on Paul George. That's foul number two for him. His second foul in as many quarters. We'll see if he backs off or stays aggressive. Here's McCullum. Ten points for him. I like when Kennard hustles on D. He's capable of making a difference on that end. Leonard against Ingram. Leonard left side. Over Ingram. And that one's long. Most nights this shot would have been his, but the defender gave him just enough trouble. Oh, Williamson throws it down. Don't sleep on Ingram as a facilitator. Has the size to see over defenders and make sound decisions. And the Clippers call time here. And the players take this opportunity to get some Gatorade. Getting some fluids in you is so important during these timeouts. Get fresh, keep those batteries charged. Yeah, without proper hydration, a player can completely run out of gas down the stretch of a ball game. 
and that's something that none of these guys can afford to have happen. If you're going to battle all the way to the finish, you have to be hydrated. have gotten five of their first six attempts to fall in the second. Here's Zubats. Yes, and it's George picking up the assist. Zubats has gotten his first bucket of the night. This is why you put the ball in his hands. An accurate pass hitting a moving target. Fournier against George. Here's McCollum. Connects on the foul line jumper. McCollum's got six here in the quarter. When McCollum is putting it all together on offense, it is fun to watch. Born score. George with the bucket. And once more this half, they find a way to get great position inside. The Pelicans have gotten seven of their first nine shots to drop during the second. McCollum against Kennard. McCollum, a pass to Valanchunas. Now here's Fournier. The D's right on him. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. It's going to go on Paul George. At the line for New Orleans, Evan Fournier. Taking two shots. First one falls for him. No good on the second, so he hits one of two. Los Angeles has gone two for two from the arc here in the second. Pass to George. It's stolen by Ingram. Now Williamson. He's guarded by Bridges. And it's Williamson penetrating. Ooh, plenty of contact on that shot. Officials call the foul, and he'll take two free throws now. The quickness of Zion is really impressive, and he has the handle to go along with it. Williamson at the line for two. Shooting two. down the first one. And so he hits both. After having no trips to the free throw line in the first period, he's being much more aggressive now. Leonard outside. Up top, George. Zubats with it. Here's Kennard. And the Clippers hit again from deep. We've seen Kadar steadily increase his three-point shots. Terrific accuracy here. Here's Valanciunas. That's in. Coming off an assist from McCullum. This is why you're trying to get him as many touches as possible. He's got the deck. Back to Leonard. Kennard outside. Pass to George. Pocket six. Bridges finds George. And again, it's the Clippers. All game long, he's been getting to his spots, and the defense has yet to adjust. Outside Ingram. 
Now Valentunas. Doesn't go that time. Great D that time from Zubats. Los Angeles has got it going from deep. Three for three so far in the quarter. Here's Bridges. Oh, oh wow! He went oh my way up. goodness! And he makes no mistake. Slam dunk. And this kind of six slam is just one of the reasons this team is in charge of this game right now, B.A. You know, there's an edge the way they play and a confidence they're not afraid to show. And the basket oh, by Williamson. Facing up, showing the jump Martin. shot. Zion saying, you can't give me that. Time called here. Los Angeles decides to talk it over. making some changes. Nance comes in for Valanchunas. And it's Jones in for Fournier. And a new group getting ready for the Clippers. Morris, he's checked in for Zubats. Batum comes in for Bridges. Norman Powell, he's checked in for Paul George. And it's John Wall in for Kennard. Now here's Batum. Well, he hasn't scored yet, but I'm sure that'll change. Leonard passes to Wall. Now Powell fires from deep. It's hauled in by Zion Williamson. Ingram finds McCullum. That one's good on the sweet setup by Ingram. Ingram's got six assists here tonight. C.J. McCullum is so crafty at finding ways to capitalize inside. What a play. Now here's Powell. 4-3. McCullum pulls it in. In this first half, he has really fallen in love with the three. So far, not paying dividends. And out of bounds, Los Angeles will have it. And the Pelicans making a change here. Alvarado's checked in. Jose Alvarado. Los Angeles has gotten 7 of 12 three-point attempts to fall. Pass to Batum. Back to Leonard. Just five to shoot. that one he's now five for eight this is what Kawhi provides 100% of effort love to take it right to you pass to Jones here's Alvarado New Orleans needs to hurry late clock Jones misses the Clippers in the lead for three, Powell gets the three ball to go. Powell's got his second basket on the night. Off the catch, Norman Powell is quick to move the ball into his shot pocket. Outside Jones. Here's Ingram. And the Pelicans miss again. Los Angeles has gone four of six from outside. Looking sharp here in the second. Batum, pass to Wall. Leonard for three. Good. Coming on the assist by Wall. Leonard's got 15 points. His shot making has been superb this quarter. He's taken over this game. Dance outside. Here's Ingram. And it falls all over the rim and in. Ingram's got four points in the quarter. Plan to Ingram's strengths. He's most effective when he gets his points within the flow of the offense. Morris for three. The shot no good. 
And New Orleans will come the other way. Here's Nance. No good on the shot. Oh, good work defensively by Morris. Powell outside. Leonard outside. Pass to Wall. Jones with the block. And they're able to recover. The timing and reach on display. Zion is unreal at coming up with rejections. So Little is checked in for the Pelicans. Herders checked in for Los Angeles. One thirty six left to play in the first half. New Orleans has gone one for three from downtown here in the second. Ingram against Herder. Outside Ingram. Pass to Jones. Five to shoot. Shot from the top of the key. The Clippers grab the miss. Now here's Herder. Inside. Now Wall. Alvarado with a rebound. Great anticipation defensively. I love how he turned an easy look into a difficult play. And you know, technically, it's a high percentage look. But this is why we play the game. Here's Wall. The Pelicans getting their last shot to go. Leonard passes to Herter. Up top Wall. Three-pointer. Sinks it from Young distance. Wall. Three. Ball's got 12 points in the game. There it is. His first make from beyond the arc in the second quarter. His third of the game. Herder against Ingram. We've got 22 seconds left in the first half. Makes good on the step back jumper. Ingram's got eight here in this quarter. Shut out in the first quarter. He's heating up now. I like the aggressiveness. Here's Leonard. And it's good. Fought through contact. Hit the shot. And will go to the line. Shooting for LA. Kawhi Leonard. One shot. And Leonard, no good on that one. Seems like every year, Kawhi Leonard averages around six or seven free throws a game. About the same as KD and LeBron. And so it's Los Angeles in command with a 13-point lead at the end of the quarter. They hold a real solid lead right now. Love their approach tonight. Well, now a minute to check in with Allie LaForce. She's courtside. Hey, Allie. Thanks so much, guys. Do a strong first half for this team. What was the mindset that gave you guys the lead? We just had to be ourselves, you know, just be ourselves, move the ball, place the unselfish, and uh, we're going to get ourselves on offense. Stay true to you, guys. Appreciate it, Allie. And we'll be coming right back after this break, ready for the third quarter. And time for us to get back into it here in game one. It's been one outstanding game from Kawhi Leonard. Through the first two quarters and change, his perimeter shooting continues to be spot on. What can you say? Shooting is a premium in this league, and you can see why. And there wasn't too much drama in the first half, but maybe things will tighten up here in the second. Checking out the group for Ty Lue to start the second half. The two-way threats of George and Leonard of the wing pair. Miles Bridges is out there with even to Zubats. And it's Wall in at the point. Fournier, the pass to Valanchunas. Off target from three-point range. The Clippers shooting 61% for the game. Knocking them down. McCollum against Wall. Oh, deflected. And it's Fournier penetrating. And a two-handed chance! 
<laughs> Talk about taking advantage of the opportunity. How about the anticipation right there that led to the steal? Then he goes straight to the bucket. Great activity at both ends. Great teamwork as well. Nails it from beyond the arc. He's been so aggressive on offense. And with the results, you understand why. You know why? Success breeds confidence. And he's certainly been successful from there time and time again. Back to McCollum. Pass to Valentunas. On the wing, Fournier. George defending. Fournier with the bucket. I love how unafraid they are to mix it up in the paint. Fournier's gone three of six from the floor. It's George on the wing. Here's the three. Valanchunas with a rebound. Valanchunas has got four rebounds now. McCullum, the pass to Ingram. Back to Fournier. Pass to McCullum. The three ball. And it's the Clippers with the rebound. Leonard with the ball. He's picked up by Williamson. Leonard against Williamson. Now here's Zubac. He's closely guarded. Parked it down low that time. Got hit with the three-second call. And now it's time to take another view of that huge swat. Yeah, this is the elevated energy level you expect in the postseason. Chasing down blocks and making an impact. New Orleans has gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the third. McCollum finds Valanchunas. Outside for Ingram. Knocks it loose. It's stolen by Leonard. Well, we're into the third quarter. Just over two and a half minutes played. It falls again. He's now 8 for 12 from the floor. On any given night, Kawhi can just take control of the offense. An elite score from all three levels. Fournier against George. Fournier, the pass to Ingram. Sends it home from three-point land. Ingram's got 11 points. That's a tough shot motion to contest. Ingram brings the ball back above his head and has a high release point. Wall, the pass to George. Unloads. Rebounded by New Orleans. Alan Tunis has got his fifth rebound in this one. Ingram on the wing. Leonard defending. Wall against Williamson. There's McCullough with the three. The Clippers grab the miss. Zubac has got four rebounds now. Bridges passes to Wall. George outside. Pass to Leonard. Takes a three. And they get it back. Oh, they get a hand on it. Back to Zubac. Stolen by Valanchunas. To the inside. Ingram. And a slam dunk by Ingram. With that impressive wingspan, Brandon Ingram can sure make plays above the rim. Wall finds George. And here's Zubac. Pass to Leonard. George with it. Fires for three. McCullum pulls it in. <laughs> Just terrible defense. I don't know how he missed that shot. And here's Ingram. Leonard defending. Shot from 16. Keeps it alive. Controls the rebound and the putback. He's got 15. Whether it be rebounding, driving the ball, in transition, Zion always looking to attack. George outside. Leonard against Ingram. Leonard passes to Wall. Six to shoot. Yes! And it's Leonard with the assist that time. Leonard's got his fourth assist in this one. New Orleans calls timeout. Without question, Kawhi Leonard displaying his skills today. You have to make it harder for him to score. Deny the ball, even double. Whatever it takes to force someone else to beat you.
Stockton for Los Angeles. Clipper substitution. The Pelicans have gone five for nine from the floor in the third quarter. Outside Ingram. Over to the wing. McCullum outside. And Fournier with the basket. On the assist by McCullum. McCollum's got three assists tonight. Bridges outside. Pass to George. Over Fournier. And he sinks that one. Hitting the back of the rim on the way in. George has got 12. I like how Paul George comes off the screen under control. Right up into his shooting motion. Smooth. Williamson misses. I'll tell you what, I think he thought that was going in. I sure did. Uses the glass on the layup. And now a 12-point Los Angeles lead. That kind of defense isn't going to stop Nicholas Batum. He pushes through the contact. Pass to Fournier. Back to Ingram. That is now his seventh field goal in ten attempts. Impressive. And force-feeding the ball inside. I mean, no reason to go away from what's working. George outside. Now Bridges. Outside Wall. Up and over McCollum. Wall no good. New Orleans has gone one of four here in the third from range. It's stolen by Wall. And the big finish by Wall. Fantastic night for Wall. Looks like the guy who tore up the league when he first arrived. Pass to Valentunas. McCullum's got space. And that one's good. Williamson. He's got 17. Now what's the saying? Don't box out. You get your feelings hurt. Porter Bridges. Valanchunas with a rebound. Valanchunas has got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. McCullum against George. Knocked loose. Oh, George with a steal. To the middle. Here's Wall. Yes, and it's George time picking up the out. assist. Wall's got ten points in just the second half. And guys, let's get your take on the hustle stats for the Clippers. Their defense, it's their defense. It has been downright incredible so far. Being disruptive and coming up with steals left and right. Well, they've also been impressive, forcing a ton of mistakes. Not only that, but converting those mistakes into points on the other end. Boy, a great performance here from John Wall. With the way he's cooking, they have to find a way to run him off his spot more. Changes for New Orleans. Littles checked in for Zion Williamson. Jones comes in for Brandon Ingram. And Alvarado is subbed in for C.J. McCullum. Outside Fournier. To the wing on the left. Valanchunas finds Fournier. Outside Jones. Jacks up a three. Drills it from deep. Jones has got his second bucket on the night. He got a clean look, and he makes the defense pay for disrespecting him. Herter passes to Morris. The wide-open shot is on the money. And the Clippers lead by 11. Yeah, credit Herter. Recognizes where the help is coming from. Finds the open man. Pass to Valanchunas. 
Jones against Powell. And the bucket is good. Jones has got five points in the quarter. Los Angeles has gone two of six from downtown here in the second half. Outside wall. Herter against Fournier. And again, it's the Clippers converting. Looks like we're starting to see a pattern here. Not afraid to get in the paint and get wet. Outside Jones. Pass to Alvarado. Out to the right wing. Now here's Jones. Six on the shot clock. For three. And it's the Clippers with the rebound. It's Herter on the wing. Defended by Jones. Jones against Herter. It doesn't go for him. And it's New Orleans taking it the other way. Jones against Powell. Two minutes. Pass minutes. to Valanciunas. Two minutes. Oh, nice finish from the low block. That one's good. Valanciunas has got six. When you earn your keep inside, you get used to fighting through contact. Valanciunas getting it done. Here's Powell. He has six. Back to Herder. From downtown, sinks the tray. Nine points in the game. Kevin's biggest selling point, the ability to shoot the ball from the perimeter. Outside Fournier. A minute 22 left to play in the third quarter. Here's Alvarado. Outside Jones. Oh, great D that time from Powell. Los Angeles has gone three of seven from deep so far in the third quarter. Morris, left side, takes the three. Jones grabs the board. Jones has got four rebounds now. There's 45 seconds left in the third quarter here. Over to the left wing. Here's Alvarado. Wall covering. The three from Valanciunas. Knocks it down from distance. Valanciunas has got five points now in the quarter. Outside wall. Powell for three. Rebounded by New Orleans. Valanciunas has got rebound number eight here already in the game. Pass to Alvarado. Here's Valanciunas. Guarded by Morris. Here's Alvarado over Wall. He got it up in time, but it would not fall for him. And so it's Los Angeles. They have a nice nine-point cushion at the end of the quarter, just pounding the painted area. That's helped them build an advantage. Back to the game after this break. And now we have a moment to reveal our State Farm assist to the game. And I'll tell you what, this was a no-brainer tonight. Take a look at the precision on this feed. Couldn't place it any better. This is why you preach teamwork. Some of the most spectacular plays are the ones where guys are feeding off one another. The fourth quarter has arrived. So good to have you with us. The Clippers in the lead. Ingram and Zion, the former Dukies, in it forward. Then there's C.J. McCollum. Then there's Jonas Valanciunas. And it's Alvarado in at the shooting guard position. That's the Pelicans' five. Masterful execution. Kawhi just has a sense for when to shoot the mid-range. Williamson with it. Here's McCollum. Kept alive. Great positioning on the putback. He really gets in perfect position for the follow. Just a terrific read. George outside. It's stolen by Ingram. Pass to Williamson. The basket drops, and he gets fouled on the shot. One free throw coming his way. 
You know, coming into the game, Zion's going to be physical. He's also going to absorb some punishment. And the Clippers making a change here. Zubox has checked in. At the line for your Pelicans, Zion Williamson. One shot. The free throw off from Williamson. And for Los Angeles, they're shooting around 59%. They've been outstanding on the offensive end. Leonard passes to George. Here's Powell. Looking to get it going. Pass to Zubats. Out to Leonard. Clock is at three. And the shot clock expires. 24 second violation. The Pelicans have gone two of three to open the fourth quarter. Now Williamson. Ingram with the ball. Back to Williamson. Puts up a three. And the three-pointer goes. Sean, he can create for others, not just himself. Zion's a big. You can run the offense through. Powell passes to Leonard. Tunis against Zubac. Down low. Here's Powell. Good setup. Led him to the rack perfectly for the layup. And the Clippers lead by six. McCullum pass to Ingram. Here's Alvarado. Pass to Ingram from behind the arc. Here's Valanciunas. And the dunk by Valanciunas. Love the flush there from Valanciunas, leaving no doubt on that play. George passes to Powell. Back to George. Stolen by Valanciunas. Now the Pelicans in transition. Here's McCollum. That shot makes him 7 for 14. He's been good tonight. And taking a quick look here at the hustle stats for the Pelicans. Their activity has been at a constant level. Always around the ball. Quick hands causing a lot of steals. Also lots of hustle on the offensive end. Following shots and creating tons of second chance opportunities. Great all-around play by a great all-around player. B.I. doing it at both ends. Timeout called. The Clippers. Coach is not happy with their effort on the defensive glass. They're giving up way too many second chance points. get a report from Allie. Guys, over the last break, I listened to Tyron Lue address the team. As this game enters its final moments, he told his guys to keep their cool, saying, quote, no sloppy play. Let's stay true to what we do best. We're almost there, gentlemen. As always, Allie, we thank you. McCullum against Powell. Clock at six. The Clippers got to hurry. Late clock here. Here's George. It's hauled in by Zion Williamson. This has been a close game in a lot of ways, but they do have an edge on the board. Oh, a clear foul there on the missed shot. So he'll get a pair at the line. It's on Norman Powell. There's that rare combination of power and athleticism. Hard to stop Zion without fouling. Two shots.
And now they lead as the free throw drops in for him. That one's no good. Unfortunate that he missed one, but he still hit a crucial point there to help get his team to lead. Leonard passes to George. To the paint. Pass to Leonard. From outside the arc. Leonard on the wing. And Kawhi Leonard gets the whistle that time. That's foul number two for him. Man, they have had a miserable quarter falling behind like this. Bridges, he's checked in for Morris. Miles Bridges. Here's New Orleans now. They're on a 14-2 run here. Here's McCollum. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. CJ has always been a gifted scorer, but he's shown significant improvement as a playmaker, which makes him even more dangerous with the ball in his hands. At the line for New Orleans, CJ McCollum. At the line for two. And the first one at the line is good. And McCollum drops them both. Clippers trail. Trying to find a spark here. Yes, indeed. A rough stretch offensively. They could really use a basket. Powell passes to Zubat. For three, George gets the three to oh, fall. A reliable jump shooter. Paul George's accuracy only goes up when he catches in rhythm. Williamson passes to Ingram. And stolen by Bridges. And he drains it. A solid five for six now. In a tight one like this, you have to trust in his ability. And it's New Orleans ball. They're on a 16 to seven run. Ingram against Leonard. And down low. Great D that time from Zubats. Los Angeles has gone one of two from deep in this quarter. They grab their own miss. The Pelicans have gone six for nine here in the fourth quarter. Outside for Ingram. Fires the three. Powell pulls it in. Powell's got his fourth rebound in this one. Three-pointer. Bridges. Rebounded by New Orleans. Up top, McCullum. Powell covers. McCullum. Pass to Valanchunas. Back to McCullum. Pass to Ingram. Down to five on the shot clock. Releases. Ingram can't get that one to fall. You know what, though? They keep calling his number despite the difficult quarter he's had. He took the contact and had an opportunity to drain it. Personal foul. First team foul. At the line for the Clippers, Miles Bridges. At the line for two. Shooting two. First free throw is good. Fournier is checked in for Alvarado. And the Clippers making a change here as well. Walls checked in.
Bridges hits them both. Now a timeout called by New Orleans. It's time to talk this over and try to put a stop to this run. Because right now, it feels like the pace is being dictated to them. They need to go back to playing their brand of basketball. Pelicans trail. McCullum outside. Pass to Ingram. Got a piece of it. Ingram against Leonard. Bridges outside. And here's Zubats. It's George on the wing. Shot clock at six. Over Fournier, and Miles Bridges is going to pick up a foul. That's his third foul so far. Third team foul. New Orleans has gone one for three in the fourth quarter from range. Fournier with the ball, and it's Leonard picking him up. McCullum against Wall. Shots good by McCollum. In traffic, CJ uses his soft touch on the interior. Ball on the attack. Cash money. Out of his 14 attempts, he's drained nine of them. Well, if you came here looking for a scoring battle, I think you made the right choice. Yeah, both teams trying to close out strong. These are the fireworks that fans came to see. McCollum on the wing. Money from the wing. McCollum's got 22 points. This is CJ's role. He's out here to score as much as possible. Ingram against Leonard. From the high post. Can't get it to drop. And it's New Orleans taking it the other way. McCollum outside. Outside Ingram. Pass to Fournier. And off the left side of the rim, it swirls in for him. And it's all knotted up. Showing what a skilled passer he is. Ingram with the beautiful dime there. Leonard finds Wall. Bridges outside. Let's it fly. Rebounded by Ingram. Ingram's got four rebounds now. Fournier, the pass to Williamson. There's a three-second violation. I hate to see that. I know everyone's mind is on the play, but you've got to protect the ball. For Los Angeles, they've gone 5 of 11 so far in the fourth. Here's Wall. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. It'll be on Zion Williamson. What an effort from Wall on the play. Refusing to let the foul stop him from taking the shot. John Wall, two shots. Shoot two. And that one falls for Wall.
and so Wall nails them both. If they keep hitting free throws at this clip, it'll help them seal the deal. Outside Ingram. Wall against McCullum. He's still feeling it. Again, the Pelicans good for two. Easy look when the defender isn't fighting over the screen. The reason why it takes extra energy to do it. You have to trust your defensive rotations, but it's worth it. Bridges passes to Wall. Out to Leonard. Pass to Bridges. For three, George. And the rebound goes to the Pelicans. Ingram's got five rebounds tonight. And Miles Bridges is going to pick up the foul. Four. That'll get him his fourth foul of the game. Four. Yeah, he tried to gain position, but couldn't quite get there. It's stolen by Leonard. Good eyes by the defense. Clearly, that's not where he wanted the pass to go, and he's frustrated. Coming out of halftime, he wanted to start strong, yet opposite happened. Outside Fournier. Pass to Ingram to take the lead. Rebound by the Clippers. He had it rolling and then lost it for some reason. Let's see if he can get it back while it still matters. He lives for moments like this because he wants to be the guy to hit the clutch shot. Ingram on the wing. The three is up. Drops in the three. Ingram's got five points now in the quarter. Hey, this is what you want out of your back guys. Ingram stepping up in the moment. George with another miss. New Orleans has got two of five threes to go here in the fourth. Williamson passes to McCullum. Can't get the go-ahead bucket. The Clippers shooting right around 40% since the beginning of the fourth quarter. It's George on the wing. Covered by Williamson. George's shot is off. New Orleans is shooting 56% today. Left side Ingram to take the lead. The rebound by Bridges. Here are the Clippers. Here's George. Got it. Good job in the low post. George has got 20 points. No moment is ever too big for Paul George. He remains confident in the clutch. McCullum outside. Pass to Fournier. Six on the shot clock. Three-pointer. Oh, nails the triple! Oh, whoa, whoa, that is as clutch as it gets. Big time play. This is why we all watch. The NBA is about these moments. Timeout called. The Clippers. They're down by one. 46 seconds left in the fourth quarter here. Let's take a look at the New Balance player of the game, John Wall. Yeah, and this game really has his fingerprints all over. He's been dominating and making it look effortless. It's always fun to watch someone just flat out take over like he's done here today.
Here's George. Back to Wall. Pass to Bridges. 34 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Leonard on the wing. Six to shoot. Over Ingram. Leonard can't get it to go. And that's an intentional foul. Good on the first, and that'll put him up two. Yeah, with McCollum at the line, the defense should be sweating. He doesn't waste many free throws. So he gets them both, and it's a three-point game. You have to admire how calm he is under pressure at the free throw line in a key situation. Timeout called. The Clippers they are trailing by three. 23 seconds left in the fourth quarter. All right, guys, what's your take? Tricky situation here. They need some kind of bucket to stay alive. Also, interesting choice to be made right here. You need either a three or a quick two and a five. the Clippers now. They trail by three. Cash! Oh, I know! An enormous three-pointer! Look, he's playing with a lot of confidence right now. He feels like no one can guard him. New Orleans calls timeout. Seconds left in the game. McCullum against Wall. McCullum outside. Over Wall. It's in! He's really finding his rhythm here. I mean, smart move to keep feeding him the ball. Let him decide whether to shoot it, whether to pass it. He's your catalyst right now. And so it's the Pelicans who come out on top here. And it always takes a lot of pressure off a team when they get the win in game one. It's the most important game of the series. They've shown they know how to beat this team. The formula's in place. Now they just have to stick with it for the next few games. All right, Allie's ready to go. She's courtside. Hey, Allie. 
Zion, this is a team with some outstanding young players with complementary skills. How do you see yourself fitting in? I think I fit in very well. Uh, I think I'm a very versatile player. You can throw me out there with any group, and I'm going to put up you know, something to contribute. Um, and I think we're a very unselfish team, so that plays a big part to it. And any group would be happy to have you. Thanks, Zion. Allie, thank you as always. Well, that'll do it, folks. Glad you could join us for the Western Conference semifinals. For Grand Hill, Steve Smith and Ali LaForce, this is Brian Anderson. Thanks for watching tonight's game. We'll see you next time.